as soon as I went on my 30, my coworker had already gotten the infant out, the five week old. Danielle was one of the first to see the crash. You're sitting there hearing them talking like they can't get them out. The truck's not moving so they can't back it up. A Tundra and Impala were stopped at the red light just across from the Taco Bell when this Dodge Ram hit the brakes hard, leaving these skid marks. We're looking at not paying attention, inattentive to driving, possibly some excessive speed. The crash crushed the Impala with kids inside. You're trying to tell the family he's okay, but you don't want to lie to him at the same time. She was most concerned about the baby girl who was in serious condition. We brought yellow towels to her to stop the bleeding or at least get it from going everywhere. And the teenage boy, she says he was pinned in the back seat and was in critical condition. To move the boy was like going so dramatically slow. And then the flight for life came and the dad showed up and the first instinct he had was to run to the car and to hear him call his son's name was so frightening. Danielle says she can't help but think of her own family. You picture your kids, you know, playing and not sitting in a car dying. And State Patrol added it's hard for them too. People think we're Superman, but a lot of it, we, we have families and kids and and relatives also, and it's tough uh, whenever you have to deal with this. Um, so we, you know, our prayers and thoughts go out to the families involved.